Here we have the uh, camera. Um, this is the small little plastic base with a little bit of um, adhesive on there. This is a, just a slight either aluminium or mild steel wire, so you can position this as required. And then when you're happy with the position, you can see it's self illuminating, so it's lighting up that in, that uh, card that we're trying to do a read here on. And uh, currently, this is just powered using a USB, but obviously you can power that using the, your uh, your five, five volt um, you know alkaline or lithium ion source, and we're working on that um, battery level. And then um, essentially, what's happening is this is in a, a, a this. ESP32 is in a local private network with a single board computer. So this is the single board computer over here. And um, that's connected to the power and to the internet. Whereas this one here is in a, just a local battery power, you know, battery powered and local network directly to this device. And then this um, phone here is currently looking at the um, read status. So you can see there, that's the image coming in from that camera. Uh, now that image may be pre-processed or, or it may be processed by the single board computer that's sort of up to the architecture to determine. Um, and then the single board computer is sort of secure and remote, but um, because it is available on the internet, um, we have put in a um, effectively a secure SSH channel where you can send a limited number of parameterized commands. And depending on the use case, we can alter those set of commands. So you can see on the screen here, this is access um, to that remote hub. So for example, we can do um, commands like a directory listing, um, you know, we can expose things like retrieving an image for diagnostics or rebooting or requesting an over-the-air update. So um, this, this basic architecture gives you a secure and um, appropriately limited set of commands to control the simple computer. Uh, the simple computer can also um, update and monitor and um, basically perform the, the role of the supervisor of um, multiple cameras. So um, that's, that's sort of how the, the hub-and-spoke architecture comes together. Cool.